Heard that someone placed a custom order. Wallet ordered some fisherman's toast. So deliver within 130 seconds without sprinting or being affected by any elements. I don't even know if this is where I should have worked. Like I have absolutely no idea. Oh. Oh no. What am I supposed to do? No. <laughs> Just follow the path, I guess. What? Go, go, go. Wait, I was... I swear I pressed the space bar to fly. What happened? Come on, why isn't it here yet? It's right here, you ungrateful brat. What? What? Where? We can pull. Let's go. Oh, it's purple. Oh my. Oh, nice. Okay. I have a lot of this character. We should try him out sometime. Look at that. I got him so many times. I don't even know why. Okay, so the resin thing is because I, a while ago, um, when I was spending resin, I ran out of resin. It gave me like the option to turn my resin, my fractured resin into regular resin. So that's why. All right, let's spend some resin. Do you guys want to do co-op? Oh man, I want to be the Luke. <gasps> I'm jealous. I want to be the Luke. <laughs> Oh, oh, this is... What? Okay, this is way quicker than Solo. Are you kidding me? I'm actually, like, mind blown right now. Like, for real. What? <laughs> Sweet flowers will do for sugar. As for salt, I found a load of rock salt in a cave the other day. And there's still plenty left. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't help myself She's so when there's cute. a chance to try something new. Hey, what do you think? <laughs> what would you think if I added a bit of slime condensate? That's... Uh, I mean, couldn't you add something a bit more normal? There's no such thing as normal ingredients to me. You can turn anything into a delicacy if you cook it in the right way. I will not stand for having my creativity shackled by what ingredients I can and can't use. <laughs> Food cooked like that is destined to be boring. Period. Mmm, <laughs> what's that smell? It's gorgeous. Ooh, she likes the way Venti smells. What is she doing? Is she kneading invisible dough? What is happening right now? Well then, show me what you got. Dang. Well, maybe I could give you some feedback. Oh my god, are you gonna backseat cook her? Who wants to eat a roast when you can taste everything except the roast? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Stop arguing. <laughs> a culinary clash of the titans. <laughs> well, there's only one surefire way out of a cooking dispute. I declare a <gasps> Suits me. If you can't beat my cooking, it'll show that draft was clearly wrong about you. Wow, this is so petty. I don't think Brooke's gonna win. For Geo Daddy. Sir, be careful. Ah, oh, another purple. Oh, cool! I don't have this character! She's cute! Okay, okay. I keep forgetting that I'm supposed to put my camera top left when I'm pulling. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. Single or tin pull. All up to you. Kiki! Sylvie! Oh, nice! Guys, why are there so many of those? For Geodity. Asa, did you know that you can get the hottest merch around at designedhumans.com slash shop slash Oh my god, we're gonna end up hitting the pity. Here we go. After this, this is it, you guys. Don't waste your money on this, okay? It makes me feel bad. 
Okay, it's purple. <laughs> Maybe we'll have a fully leveled Chongyun. It's possible. Maybe. That'd be nice. Ah! <laughs> oh my god. He's fully leveled! Uh, okay, I guess we're gonna do singles then. Purple. Ooh! I think Razor's close too, actually. <gasps> A maxed out Razor! I really like Razor, so this is actually... Th those were actually some really good pulls. I know I didn't get Geodaddy, but... Wait, 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 there's spikes. <laughs> I read that this boar was hunted to extinction because its meat was so highly prized. Condensate of jumbo cryoslime and extinct boar? Not one, but two priceless treasures! This is honestly, like, unfair. We should probably get disqualified for this. Like, how is this fair? What's her name? Beth? I don't know what her- I don't remember her name. She's gonna be cooking up, like, a- like, a basic chicken or something, and we're like... <laughs> Bring in the exotic meat. Brooke. I'm sorry, Brooke. <laughs> a rare exotic meat like Paimon. Yeah, like Paimon. Uh, oh. Are you sure this is Springvale? They look the same, see? Oh, so he like great, 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 great grandpa of Draft. I can't remember which generation it was from, but it was definitely on there. So, a great, 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 great grandfather, but with a whole lot more greats? What an unusual turn of events! <laughs> Reunited at long last! Isn't that just how amazing? did How did a story about, like, cooking and, like, doing a cooking contest turn into a story about a great-great-great-great-grandfather being preserved and frozen? Whoopee! I win! Of course we won! <sighs> I thought I was sure to win with pork chops so fresh they were practically still grunting. Well, honey, I mean, did you really think that pork chops was a good option for a cooking contest? Chang the Ninth, how are ya? Uh, the heavens are smiting me. To pay off my debts, I had no choice but to pawn off my beloved book collection. Every last book. Do you have any idea what that means? Wrong. That was my life's work. I'm sorry. Hey, Chang. <laughs> Uh -oh. You've got some nerve keeping me and my boss waiting like this. I need an answer. Will you sell the Corlapis or not? Perhaps you'd like to take your books with you to an early grave. Do you ever just wanna... Wow, so that's how that turned out. This whole passage is just... extraordinary. Ugh, this guy is so annoying! <laughs> From now on, he shall be known as... Geek. Ooh, that one cuts deep. Oh, join Lee. Okay then. Um, guess we're getting Geo Daddy. meet him yet in the story but i saw him in the trailer very cool i'm very excited thank you so much you guys <laughs> this was not streamer luck this was a pity pull <laughs> but yeah thank you solidify oh that's actually really cool Bind oh okay the same as i remember oh my gosh i wasn't expecting him to sound like that that's a deep voice. The dragon spine update is here. I have enough for two pulls. Listen, I'm not gonna pull him. The thing is, right? The thing is, I, I just use my pity. <laughs> yeah. I'm excited to do the main story again. Oh yeah, I don't know who's stronger, him or Klee. I can't, I can't even tell at this point. They're both so strong. Oh yeah, has anybody tried Albedo yet? Has anybody gotten it? I like his character design. How about a quick break so I can sketch Aww. this beautiful scenery? What an adorable character. My great undertaking. Oh, look at that. Look at me. 
Well, this is nice. Wow. How sweet of them. All right. Uh, pulls or start quest? Main, main quest. We're going to be doing main quests. Should I go to Dragon Spine first or should I do my quest first? I don't know what to do. There's so much to do. <laughs> okay, let's do one pull and then we'll do another pull later. How about that? I'm, I'm gonna spread it out. Oh yeah, I was gonna do a pull. Uh, don't expect anything good because we already had our pity recently. So prepare for um, Bennett. <laughs> Purple, that's not bad. What did I say? I think I manifested that. Whoops. My bad. Awesome. Wait, you don't get another one from that? Oh, you'd have to ascend twice? Okay, that was a fail. Michelin. Oh, okay. Thank you for telling me. I'm like not... Okay. Oh, perfect. Okay. Thank you. Wow, I'm such a dweeb. Okie doke. What would I do without you guys? <laughs> okay, here we go. Oh, okay. Welcome, friend of child. And congratulations on the first day of your illustrious career with the Fatui. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm down for a cook-off. I understand. I do. Please, do not worry. Hmm. The subordinate I sent was not quite so optimistic in his appraisal. Is somebody being uncooperative? You know I would not this dream of disappointing you, don't very you? Very spicy. We shall see when the time comes. I was not expecting that at all. Ooh, I feel like I'm stealing. I feel like I just robbed the bank. Chat told me to do it. Seriously looks like he belongs in Persona. As promised, I found someone who can help you. Yay, we're gonna go meet Zhongli! Zhongli has like the coolest voice in the game, in my Hi. opinion. Allow me to introduce Mr. Zhongli, consultant to an organization known as Wang Sheng, and a trusted associate of the Fatui. Discretion? Shadows? <sighs> Is Wang Sheng some kind of business involving dealing <laughs> with people? Indeed. It is as you have guessed. What? <laughs> <laughs> Did you think he was some sort of hired killer? I brought you to meet Mr. Zhongli because... Because I can bring you to see Rex Lapis's vessel. Oh? What? Traveler, Child has told me a lot about you. Since you have had dealings with the Animal Archon, could I ask you to help me prepare the Geo Archon's last rites? A child says too much. <laughs> uh, I'll accept. A wise decision. How pretty it is in here. Oh, it's so pretty. Bedding? No, no, we're here for... Um... What was it again? I'm on his me. Dr. Lucas J. Always forgetting. Of radiant grade at the very least. Go on, pick whichever one you like. A man who makes his living off betting on stones can't be trusted so lightly? Let's not be so uptight, okay? What do you think, Mr. Zhongli? Oh, you want me to decide? That is fine as well. <laughs> if it were me, the answer would be simple. I'll take them all, boss. Mm. Oh, Mora. Hmm. It is as you say. I suppose I overlooked this particular aspect of the transaction. Oh, he rich, rich. How do you not think about Mora when buying things? He's rich. If one must always consider Mora before acting, then in all things one is bound by Mora. Sounds like he's loaded! <laughs> Ugh, you ignorant shoppers. Always coming in here with your stupid questions. Golden Housemaiden, Valley Weaver, and Fate's Yearning. One of each to start with, if you don't mind. My goodness, this gentleman is quite the connoisseur. How does this man expect to get good business servants. talking to his customers like Please that? Please refrain from any further attempts to contribute. What? This is what I get for calling Paimon emergency food? 
Now then, please peruse at your leisure. Just pick one. Perhaps you don't know. Now that's settled. A question. <clears throat> Do you have any mora on you? What's up with that? Since these flowers will be used to glorify our Lord, they're free of charge. Just don't forget to pass on my regards. Thanks, Boli. Are you serious? Thank you, boss. That's wholesome. I think I speak for all of us when I say that your generosity has saved our skins. Our skins? You were the one who forgot <laughs> to bring money. I think Zhang Li might have some credit card debt or something going on. <laughs> you smell great. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> well, hello. You found me at last. I've been waiting for you. What? How did you know we were coming? Oh, I heard a rumor about a couple who were snooping around town looking for a sweet-smelling lady. <laughs> you have extreme tastes for someone your age. Maybe the rumors I heard were true after all. You're what? on the cow and need some sweet-smelling ammunition. <laughs> is that it? Okay, this is going a little bit too far. You got a problem with that? I'm, I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. I'm gonna say it. You had a problem with that? Ay, ay, ay. Who let this tiger out of the cage? <laughs> now, I need you to extract the silk flower essence using a crafting bench. Why are you talking Perfume to me like that? Perfume making uses an altogether different technique from alchemy. Here, let me teach you. Very carefully, take hold of the mortar and pestle. Gently does it. You need to keep your wrist firm so your hand doesn't slip. Now use your strong hand to stir it with a persistent rhythm. Keep going until the juices start to come out. I swear, I swear, I really don't have a dirty mind, but like... <laughs> All right, children, there is no need to worry. I didn't place the bell very far away. I want Madame Ping to bake me a nice apple pie and read me a bedtime story. We're going in! We're going into a teapot. This music. Youngsters, this is where this old woman keeps all her things. Quickly this is now, interesting, and the music is gorgeous. Whoa, this is actually really cool. That sounds like Granny's voice. The heck? So, this is her wow, this is so cool! Look, it's the bell! We did it! This is so cute. Indeed, this is the cleansing bell. Here we go. It's in good condition. So what's the next step in our preparations? Hmm. Next, we need to purchase kites. Well then, Granny Shen, I shall take these back with me. As for the payment... As for the payment, he says, he's got no money! Well, allow me. Oh! Okay. Oh, by the way, take this bag of money. You probably won't want to let Zhang Li do the bargaining, if you know what I mean. Hmm, seems I missed out on some interesting information. I suppose I'll just have to find a more opportune moment next time. What? What do you mean, child? That is very suspicious of you to say. Chi Chi? Huh. The reception is deserted. And it seems kind of spooky in here. Hello? Is anybody there? Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. Yay! <gasps> Chi Chi! <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, there you are. But you can't even reach the counter. Is she a zombie? <laughs> that one's funny too. Ah. Oh. Paimon thinks you might be right. 
Look at the talisman on her forehead! Welcome to Boo Boo Pharmacy. I am Chi Chi. Aww. Once upon a time, Chi Chi died. Then, Chi Chi was saved by the Adepti. Now, Chi Chi is a zombie. <laughs> I love this. Something like this would be unimaginable in Mondstadt. Excuse me, sir. Did you bring your prescription? <laughs> I... Surely no prescription is needed to purchase everlasting incense. It's not a controlled substance. Chi-Chi can get your medicine. But only if you show Chi-Chi your prescription. These are Chi-Chi's orders from Chi-Chi. Go to Mount Tianhong, find the Guizhong Ballista, and hunt a cocoa goat. Please and thank you. I don't want to hunt a goat. I really like goats. Oh yeah, that! So we've got the Guizhong Ballista working, but where's our cocoa goat? A search using the Guizhong Ballista revealed no significant life forms nearby, save for the usual wildlife. We found no trace of the Coco Goat Adepti Beast of which you speak. No Coco Goat. <sighs> what a disappointment. Coco Goat milk is tasty. So tasty. Much better than normal goat milk. Only an Adepti Beast could make such tasty milk. Ah, here. This is the name. Coconut milk. <sighs> It's time to tell you where coconut milk comes from. No. Im impossible. Thank you all for looking after my little Chi-Chi. Oh, who are you? Might I ask who? Ah, oh, how rude of me. I'm Baiju, boss of the Boo Boo Pharmacy. Hi, the snake is so Chi -Chi cute. The this little mascot is even more of a simpleton than Chi-Chi. <gasps> Do you sell everlasting incense in this fine establishment? Everlasting incense? Why, of course we do. Three million mora. Top quality. Guaranteed. I like Baizu. <laughs> That's expensive, though. We might though. as well just rob the golden house. What are we gonna do? Is this the part where we go crawling back to child? Twenty minutes later. <laughs> <laughs> Coco goat. <Sweet>. Coco go <laughs> He's my spying! Oh my goodness. I cannot believe you fell for that. That lot is an absolute riot. Honestly, I can't remember the last time I laughed so hard. So, you've been eavesdropping, I hope. What have I missed? Oh. Yes, Master Child. They spoke of the Qixing taking the Golden House. Well, well, well. Ningguang and her Qixing cronies. What else would they be hiding in the Golden House, if not the Exuvia? I apologize, but I warned you, didn't I? As the old Leo is saying goes, oh, the walls have ears. Oh, yeah? I have not been to Dragon Spine yet. I am going to be going very soon. I just wanted to finish uh, the level 29 main quest first. Tonight, I shall take you both to an old hole in the wall, praise throughout Leo. Besides fine wine, the excellent ambiance is the reason why this place is so well loved. Behold, the glorious sights of Liyue Harbor, stretching out far and wide. Who the heck? They say <laughs> that when Lady Ningguang ponders important affairs, she retreats to her jade chamber with none but her three closest confidants in tow. I love these. The rarest treasures in the land are the words brought by the paper snow. For the words of the Tianquan have the power to move mountains, and all throughout the land know it. Literally gorgeous. At last I have found you. You who returned from Juayun Karst. Oh, is it the person we just saw? I don't know. Wait, uh. I am not with the Millilith, nor am I here to claim your bounty. However, I am an emissary of the Liyue Qixing. My name is Ganyu, secretary at the Yuahai Pavilion. 
and I have come specifically to meet you. She's adorable! Ah! <laughs> I'm obsessed! I have with me a letter from Lady Ningguang. She extends a formal invitation to you in her capacity as Tianquan. She invites you to her palace in Wait. the sky. An official invitation? Wait! Lady Ningguang said this. She's modeled after a goat? The bell and the horns? She's a goat? Can I... Can I pull her? You guys might not know this about me. You might not know this about me, but... Goats are my favorite animal. You'd best be on your way now. But don't forget about the rite of parting. Once you've finished at the Jade Chamber, meet me at Dihua Marsh. Don't worry, we won't forget. Dihua Marsh. We'll see you there. Can I help you? <gasps> oh, Sucrose! Huh. Looks like Timaeus isn't here today. <laughs> Customers? Every character in this game is cute, let's be real. Pardon me. Are you looking for Timaeus? I'm Sucrose, Albedo's assistant. If you have any alchemy-related queries, you could always ask me. I do my best to help. <laughs> no need to be huh? nervous. D do I look nervous? <laughs> so cute! Uh, my apologies. I don't get out too often. Hey, aren't you the legendary traveler? The one who repelled Storm Terror? <laughs> And I don't even charge for autographs. Thank you. <laughs> Albedo is the Knights of Favonius chief alchemist. He's also Timaeus and my teacher. I'm afraid you'll have to go to the entrance to the pass and look for him by yourselves. Look out for a refined gentleman with the presence of a true scholar. Here we are. <laughs> Sister Rosaria, so here you are. Choir practice is about to... <laughs> I've told you already, I don't go in for that kind of thing. I've got more important matters to attend to. I thought I heard something. <gasps> Who are you and why are you eavesdropping? This is exciting. La, la, la. Uh. Whoa, 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 what happened there? I need warmth. I'll always be warm if I use clean. Riptide. I don't exactly know what this does, I just really wanted to do it, so... Whoa. <gasps> There's Albedo! Is that Albedo? Why would he hang around a place like this? Hmm... I'm afraid the answer isn't easy to explain. If you'd like to have a look at my sketch, it may give you a clue. Nah... Do you have any extra organs? A second heart? What?! A fourth stomach? Things of that nature. Yeah, I got three gallbladders. You want one? I was merely considering the possibility that you were an external organ. Perhaps <laughs> there is some invisible force connecting you. Uh, I caught Paimon with my fishing rod. <laughs> Time for the results. We got a myriad of data today. And it was very difficult to finish all the research in one go. But the integral preliminary conclusion that I can offer you is... You're very much like a human from this world. <laughs> Albedo, what? You couldn't tell that just by looking? Albedo, Paimon really wants to be your friend. Thank you both. Even if dispelling loneliness is not essential for life, it certainly doesn't hurt. We're friends. I'm gonna go to sleep soon because I'm very tired. I hope you guys get some good rest. On, um, Let's go. The and yeah, thanks for hanging out. I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys did too.